Hey, this is Mark Bishop and uh, welcome to my drop mock demo. Okay, so this is going to be kind of a walkthrough um, demonstration really of um, Lee Pennington's uh, brand new software. Now this is um, particularly interesting to me because I love the uh, design aspect. Personally, I think um, you know the actual design of a website, the design of anything online really helps sell. It helps sell an awful lot more than um, than you know text alone or videos or something like that. For me, you know, the design element is um, very very important. So, without rambling on too much, let me um, just explain this software. Okay, so it's um, it's a SaaS software, so um, it's in the cloud. You don't have to download anything. Um, and what it does is it comes with uh, all of these mock-ups. Um, I've spoken to Lee and there's more to follow, but there's an awful lot in here already. So let's say you wanted to put your image on to say a desktop or a laptop or something like that. So you can see just by clicking over here, you can select all of the uh, desktops and laptop mock-ups that are currently in the software. And here, tablets. So what have they got here, tablets? Okay, so there's a number there. Uh, smartphones, laptops. Uh, there's, there's an awful lot there. Uh, cups. Uh, sketches. So I guess you could uh, you could put your image on this guy carrying a sign here or inside this concert venue here. Or let's see, people. Okay, let's um, let's try this. So, if I choose this one here, all I would need to do is click on the little cross icon there. So if I do that, now you, I can either grab um, details from um, a website URL here, just by putting in the details there, the URL there, or I can grab an image from my desktop here. So I'm gonna do that and Let's use this one here. Okay, so you can see that the uh, software comes with um, an image editing. Um, it's kind of just scale and crop and that kind of thing. But uh, that was the right size, so I'll crop that one. And then you can see it's added on to this girl's vest here. Now, when you download this particular image, then the um, the drop mark watermark up here will not show. This is just um, in place so you can do as many previews as you like. Okay, so once you download, that will not show. So you can see here that um, rather than just stamping um, the image as a block onto the um, the girl's vest here. What it's actually done is it's um, actually followed the contours and the lighting of the picture. So you can see here that um, there's lighting on the girl's vest just here, and that also takes effect over the logo that I've just added on here. And you can see the contours are also followed in the image that I've used. Okay, so it actually looks like the girl is wearing a vest with my logo on it. Okay, so let's do another one now and um, let's take a look at this one here. Now the reason I'm gonna have a go with this one is because of the angle. Now if you've ever tried to do this with Photoshop or GIMP or something like that, you know, it does take a little bit of effort um, pulling the image around to make it look like it was there all along. So. Okay, so you can see that it's taken the actual angle of the uh, the phone in this case. Okay, let's um, let's drop something on here. And now you can see it's just um, dropped that at the right angle into the laptop there. Okay, so I've downloaded, I've actually produced this image here and um, I clicked download. It saves the image then. Um, so this will be the first time that I've looked at it. Let's just uh, 
Let's take a look at that now. So you can see that I've got a saved image there with um, the girl wearing a vest with my logo on it. Okay, so as well as just producing the mock-ups, um, what you can actually do here is you can use these as uh, MEMS as well. So you've seen MEMS on Facebook, that kind of thing. So what you do is produce your image here. So you can see that I've just put my logo in there. And then if I click on text effect and then choose either standard image or high definition. Um, for this demonstration, I'm just gonna to stick to the standard image. So click there and then it opens up the image editor. So you can do a number of different things here. And this is the first time that I've opened this. So uh, let's have a look. So let's try effects. So if I click there, it opens up a number of different effects. So these are kind of like filters. So let's just um, let's have a look. Uh, kind of like um, like a scaled down version of Photoshop, really. So it means you can do complete mockups with your images embedded into the um, into the mockup area, and then you can add any kind of filter that you like. Okay. So let's apply that. You can um, frames. You could put a frame around it if you wanted to, like so. And uh, if you download the high definition image, then obviously it's a lot bigger. So this is perfect for web design. You can see the image that I've made here using drop mod. You can see that's uh, that's a fair old size. So that's going to be perfect for um, for website design, that kind of thing. So what can you actually use this product for? Well, if you're like me um, and you do a lot of designing online, then this is uh, the perfect tool. You're not going to need to use Photoshop or anything like that. It does it all for you right inside of the software and it's cloud based. So it's not something that's going to clog up your computer. OK, so you can see this is a great piece of software. Now you might be wondering how you're going to actually use it, how it's going to make you money. Well, as I said at the beginning of this video, if you're anything like me and you do a lot of design online, then this is the perfect tool. It will allow you to put your logo, your images onto loads of uh, graphics inside of the software and download those graphics to use um, for building out products, for building out websites, um, sales pages, any kind of design you like. But you can also use it for putting memes on Facebook for Facebook advertising. So, you know, all those little Facebook adverts, those little images, it's perfect for that. You can also, if you wanted an instant uh, stream of income, you could come over to places like um, Fiverr, for example, and um, you could just drop people's logos onto, um, onto the images, onto T-shirts, anything like that. In fact, there's one there. It's... Um, 228 orders let's, um, let's click on there I mean if you search through any of these sites you can see that um, it's an in-demand service so there's four orders in the queue there and there's there's additions as well so you can see straight away that you know you could you could generate income just just by using drop mock with um, places like Fiverr um, source wave that kind of thing you could set up your own services you could work for, or you could um, tap into t-shirt designers, you could tap into local businesses, you know, putting their details on a mug, for example, or on their cards, or on any kind of literature that they can put on their website. Now, I'm sure you've got a ton of ideas on how to use Dropmark yourself, but let me just um, assure you this is a fantastic piece of software. Yeah, it may not be for everybody if you're not into design or you don't want to use something like Fiverr, but this really is great. If you use 
Photoshop at the moment and you do this kind of thing, this is going to save you a ton of time and it works exceptionally well.